In this video, our final discussion of the rigid rotor model will discuss the eigenvalues of the angular momentum operators. So our rigid rotor wave functions are the spherical harmonic functions, y, j, m of theta phi, j and m being quantum numbers where j starts at zero and goes up to infinity, taking on integer values, zero, one, two, three, etc. And m can go from minus j to plus j as integer values theta and phi being the angular coordinates in spherical polar coordinates, theta the polar angle and phi the azimuthal angle versus the z-axis in the xy plane. Those equal a normalization constant, square root of 2j plus 1 over 4 pi, j minus absolute value of m factorial over j plus absolute value of m factorial, times the associated Legendre polynomial pj absolute value of m of cosine theta times the complex exponential e to the minus or e to the i m phi. Our Hamiltonian operator is just kinetic energy. Our potential energy is zero. So in angular terms, our kinetic energy is equal to angular momentum over two times the moment of inertia. So angular momentum represented by the angular momentum operator squared. Angular momentum operator squared equals negative h bar squared times this value in parentheses, 1 over sine theta dd theta of the product sine theta dd theta, plus 1 over sine squared theta times the second partial derivative with respect to phi. So the L squared operator is the total angular momentum squared. The total angular momentum squared is equal to the x component squared plus the y component squared plus the z component squared. So our wave functions, our spherical harmonics, they are eigenfunctions of the L squared operator. They're also eigenfunctions of the LZ squared operator. But not only are they eigenfunctions of LZ squared, they're also eigenfunctions of LZ. So these angular momentum component operators are, can be derived from the definition of angular momentum. Angular momentum is the cross product of the position and momentum operators. So the x component operator is y pz minus z py. Then we do cyclic permutations. Ly is z px minus x pz, p being the momentum. Lz equals x py minus y px the x, y, and z being the subcomponent of the linear momentum. So these all equal minus i h bar y d d z minus z d d y, etc. down the line. But luckily, LZ has a more convenient form in terms of the spherical polar coordinates, which is minus i h bar d d phi. So we have our eigenfunctions of the Hamiltonian are also eigenfunctions of L squared and LZ total angular momentum squared and the z component of angular momentum. So we have an eigenvalue equation for both of them. L squared of y j m theta phi equals h bar squared j times j plus one, quantum number j, times the same function y j m of theta phi. For L z, we have L z acting on y j m of theta phi equals h bar m y j m of theta phi. So these here, in highlighted in orange, are the eigenvalues of these operators for our given spherical harmonic wave functions. If you take any of these given wave functions and you act on them with L squared, you should find that you'll get h bar squared j times j plus 1 times the function back. If you act on any of the spherical harmonics with LZ, you should get h bar m times the function back. So these eigenvalues tell you what the total angular momentum squared is and what the z component of the angular momentum is. So the angular momentum, the total angular momentum, is the square root of this. So the angular momentum of a given function is going to be h bar times square root of j times j plus 1, whereas the z component of that is going to be h bar m. So this is used uh, both in this chapter for the spherical harmonics as the rigid rotor wave functions and also in the next chapter as the spherical harmonics are the angular part to the wave function for the hydrogen atom atomic orbitals. So the, whenever we're talking about angular momentum we're typically talking about these two operators 
and our spherical harmonics are eigenfunctions of that which will give these eigenvalues for our total and z component of the angular momentum.